The Nigeria Economic Summit Group has announced the launch of a live policy tracker to monitor the implementation of economic reforms advanced by the group to the government as the summit enters its 30th edition. This announcement was made at the start of the Nigeria Economic Summit in Abuja themed collaborative action for growth, competitiveness and stability. Vice President Kashim Shatima, who represented the president, opened the summit, which is scheduled to run till Wednesday. Victoria Ayorinde completes the story. Nigeria's poverty rate has become a present concern with approximately 40.1% of the population living below the poverty line. This translates to around 84 million people struggling to make ends meet. However, there is a glimmer of hope as the multidimensional poverty index has shown a decline from 0.25 in 2022 to 0.17 in 2023. To address the poverty rate in Nigeria, the 30th Nigerian Economic Summit that kick started today in Abuja has convened regional and global leaders from government, business, civil society, the social sector and academia to address pressing economic realities in Nigeria. The theme for the 2024 summit is Collaborative Action for Growth, Competitiveness and Stability. The Vice President Kashim Shetima, representing the President Bola Tinobu, emphasized that Nigeria has immense potential for growth and development and that the administration is committed to enhancing the potentials for the nation's progress and to create an inclusive economy that empowers self-scale businesses to thrive. Like many other nations, Nigeria has experienced significant economic turbulence over the past few years. The challenges have been global as well as domestic, ranging from the COVID-19 pandemic and fluctuation oil prices to internal security issues, inflation and structural weaknesses in our economy, such as over-reliance on oil revenue and lack of economic diversification. Your Excellencies, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, Nigeria's growth trajectory has been volatile, heavily dependent on oil revenues and unable to create enough jobs to keep pace with our rapidly growing population. As a nation, we must prioritize economic diversification. Your role in this process is crucial. Considering this, the present administration, through the renewed hope agenda, has embarked on bold and courageous reforms designed to create an environment that fosters sustainable economic growth and shared prosperity. Minister of Budget and Economic Planning Atiku Bagudu emphasized the importance of collaboration for Nigeria's economic growth. He stressed that planning is key to economic prosperity and has called for a constitutional provision for a joint planning board between state and local government for effective planning. The summit come, came at a critical juncture in the nation's social and economic trajectory as a new administration that took up in May 2023 was settling in office, having campaigned on a renewed hope agenda and strategy. It focused on crafting immediate and long-term strategies for fostering economic growth and development. The summit recommendation continue to inspire government to reform critical sectors of the economy. For instance, the 29th summit emphasized the urgent need to tighten foreign exchange rules, broaden official market and harmonize fiscal and monetary policies for a balanced approach to economic stability. It highlighted infrastructure development as pivotal to sustainable economic growth, recommending, recommending prioritizing power generation, road networks, and transportation system. Chairman of the Nigerian Economic Summit Group, Niyi Yusuf, highlighted the importance of prioritizing institutional reforms to create lasting solutions for Nigeria's growth. Today's challenges demand a new approach that is centered on collaboration to promote growth, competitiveness, and stability. Sir Albert Einstein noted, you cannot solve problems at the level of thinking that created them in the first place. Hence, I believe this admonition has great implications for us in Nigeria today, as a rad radical paradigm shift is required in our individual and collective mindsets, and our philosophy must change to one that supports and propels economic transformation. The reemergence of a dominant, globally competitive, and prosperous Nigeria is predicated on systemic changes in our values, 
in our leadership and consensus on what matters most and commitment, great commitment to the rule of law, economic development, social stability, and democratic accountability. However, stakeholders hope that this summit will catalyze discussions and mobilize leaders to address pressing economic challenges, navigate uncertainties, and foster an environment that encourages innovation, diversification, and sustainable development. Victoria Ayonite, reporting for Kaftan TV. Thank you.